Hi everybody, Hans Meister here, School of Life. Um, glad you could join me today. Flexible measure tape, right? Always a mess. You roll it up, okay, and then you put a rubber band around it, and once you have it rolled up, it's gonna, you know, try, try to fall out or be all over the place and hard to store and all that. So, if you haven't watched the video with the rope, how to um, roll up the rope, um, click subscribe watch that video okay we're gonna do this the same way except we're not gonna wrap a tie around it so here we go very simple both open ends together okay open ends together now we're gonna roll it up double okay not single like usually but double it's gonna be tighter that way all right so we're gonna do this nice and easy like so and we're gonna keep it flat like so Okay, and I'm gonna let this open up. So we're gonna keep it nice and tight. And I don't know if that shows well on the camera right now, but here, we're just gonna finish that guy off. And don't worry about this end. This end always will come out flat, no matter what, all right? So once I'm at the end like this, I'm gonna keep them fastened like with one of these regular office paper clips you can use any size you want you may have to adjust the length of your roll up so you have don't have too much thickness or not enough okay so you can put it on like this all right so now you can go in your garage hang it on one of your pegs or screw nail whatever you know or you can put it if you have a, a magnetized holding thing or even on your you have a magnet on your refrigerator you know click it on there so you can do it this way course needless to say it can go on this way too right when well, if you put it on like this okay it's gonna I mean it's it's just stiff it's not gonna gonna be able to come undone or anything like that right now there is one one more thing you need to know so you, this is one okay and then I have one this one by the way this was before I forget this was five feet long 60 inches and um, so relatively short but you know if you measure stuff for your garments or going to the store with it because you don't want to bring a tape measure you may need only like a, a shorter one but if you have one of these right I think can you remember what this was this was 120 so all right so we're talking about a what is, what is on that's 10 foot right 10 foot so a 10 footer is going to get a little bit you know um, thicker and a little bit harder to do with the clips because they're going to get bulkier. So what I do with this guy here, I want to roll it up the same way. But before I do, okay, I'm going to take two of my clips, right, and I'm going to put these boogers together like so. Okay, and you're going to see in a minute why. And I'm going to take like a, see that? I'm going to take my measurement, like a, you know, just a, a rough measurement, obviously. I'll put my finger on here. And now I'm going to roll that up, fold it first. Okay, that's my first fold, so that's my measurement. And you'll see in a second here why. So I'm going to just keep rolling this guy up just like that, okay? <clears throat> You're going to wonder, hey, if it's long like this, gonna it's going to be all over the place and whatnot, all right? Not going to happen. Watch. Just bear with me. We're almost there. We're almost there. See? And again, even though it's long and whatnot, but it stays tighter because you're rolling it double and not single like you usually would on a regular loop, right? So again, the end won't matter. It'll fall in place wherever it falls in place, right? So here we go. This one wants to go this way, so we're just going to kink it out. All right. So now I'm going to use two of these guys, and that was the measurement, okay? One goes in like this, just like I showed you before, but now you're going to fold these guys down, right? And you do the same thing at the other end. Take it, and you fold it down. Now, I made this a little bit too long because it's now it's kind of doing this so I tell you what let's do this see I even mess up on camera trying to teach you so that's okay we'll do this again I'm gonna keep them a little bit shorter because when you take the measurement you want to go about a quarter inch shorter because you're going to end up adding thickness to it as you roll it up okay so one more time let's see here let me get the open ends here 
open ends and I'm gonna get all my kinks out make sure this guy is flat which it's not I got this one all yeah. all right so we'll do this one more time <clears throat> We're not going to edit nothing. We're not going to cut this. It's called real life, people. Nothing ever works out the way it's supposed to. And if it does, hit people ready, right? So, in this case, I guess I sort of kind of messed up. So, here, we're going to do this a little bit shorter, like, like so, okay? And here, I even go a little bit shorter even there. So, am I still in focus here with the camera? All good? Yeah? Alright, you guys. So, I'm going to roll this booger up. That's right. I call it a booger. It's a tape. It's a booger. It's a boogala. It's a thingy. It is what it is. And this is how we do it. So, here. Almost there. Almost there. So, you just want to squish it a little bit so it stays nice and flat. <coughs> So we've gotten to the end, and now, <laughs> my camera person is being funny. Hey, now, stay with me. Here we go. We're going to fold this over, and in case this other one is overlapping this, not only does it matter, it's going to stiffen this whole thing out. That's why I was saying two over and over, right? So there you have it. That's what you do with the 10-footer. It's going to, look at this. I mean, it's going to flex, but I mean, it's going to stay nice and, and sturdy. And you can do the same thing. Pull one of these guys up. And there you go. You can hang it. I mean, you would look at it this way, right? So you hang it wherever you want to hang it. Or put it in your pocket. You know, it won't get tangled up. It won't do any of, you know, the, you know, coming apart and then getting, you know, you're going to have to play with this whole mess. So this is how I do it rocket science there just a simple trick I hope you guys enjoy it and let me know what you think and uh, thanks for joining me and then uh, we'll see you on the next one bye bye